Over 20.9 million men, women and children are victims of human trafficking. But do you know what human trafficking actually is? In a small sleepy town, people are dreaming. But not everyone's dreams will come true. Human traffickers prey on people's dreams and lure them away for their own benefit. How do they do this? Human trafficking doesn't happen all of a sudden. It's a process. First, traffickers act. This includes recruiting victims, transporting them to the place where they'll be exploited, hiding them from authorities, and receiving victims from other traffickers. So why don't the victims run away or say no? Because traffickers use different means. This includes threatening or forcing victims to do what they want, abducting or deceiving the victims and abusing power. Sometimes traffickers promise small payments or benefits to get the victim to cooperate. And why are the traffickers doing this? The purpose of trafficking is exploitation. Traffickers take advantage of victims for their own profit or benefit. This is human trafficking. This man's neighbor tells him that he has a great job for him on a very safe construction site and that he'll be paid a lot of money. With more money, he can make his dreams come true. He agrees to take the job. A few days later, the neighbor's friend picks him up and they drive to the construction site. It's a very long way from his home. This man is put to work immediately, without any training or protective equipment, without enough to eat or drink, and with very few breaks. After many months, he's only been paid a fraction of what he was promised. He knows he's been tricked, but he doesn't have enough money to get home. This man is a victim of human trafficking. He was recruited by his neighbor and tricked into thinking he was going to work at a safe construction site for fair pay. Instead, he was forced to work long hours in unsafe conditions for almost no money, while others benefited from his exploitation. One day, while looking for jobs online, this woman comes across an opportunity to work in a restaurant in a big city. Her application is successful, and her new employer arranges for her travel there. She is met at the airport and driven to a part of the city that looks nothing like she expected. The car pulls up to a building. The door is shut and locked behind her. She is made to perform sex acts against her will. She is trapped. This woman is a victim of human trafficking. She was transported by a trafficker from the airport to the location of the job. When she arrived at the location and realized it was not the restaurant job she was expecting, the traffickers used force to keep her there. She was then exploited for forced sex work. This 14-year-old boy on school break is approached on the street by a woman who looks trustworthy. She tells him that she needs workers at her factory and she promises him lots of money. He brings her to meet his parents. They are so happy for him. He'll now be able to save money for school. The woman drives him to the next town. They pull up to an old building. There is someone waiting for him. As he is led inside, the nice lady drives off. The factory isn't anything like she described. There are lots of people working, including many children. He works all day, and after just a few hours of sleep, he starts again. He is sad. This isn't what he expected. He misses his family. After weeks, he still hasn't received any salary or been allowed to contact them. He is trapped. This boy is a victim of human trafficking. He was tricked by the woman who recruited him on the street. He was then received by a trafficker when he arrived at the factory and exploited by being forced to sew clothing. For anyone under the age of 18, only the act and purpose matter for it to legally be a case of human trafficking. Understanding that human trafficking doesn't happen all at once, 
but instead is a process of act, means, and purpose, helps us better identify victims and trafficking trends. People everywhere are dreaming and looking for opportunities to make those dreams come true. Human trafficking is happening all around us. Will you recognize it when you see it? To learn more, visit iomx.org.